Hey guys, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to add on a set of mockups if you're on Windows. So if you've already bought a set of mockups before or multiple mockups, this video is going to show you how you can add those on so you can pick and mix and build your own set of incredible actions. So with that said, let's get into it. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is open up Photoshop uh, and get that ready. And then I'm going to go and have a look in my download folder for the download of the next actions, which are here. So what I'm going to do is just move them over to my desktop. You don't need to do that. You can do it right in your download folder if you want. Totally optional. Then I'm going to right click and extract all. Click extract. And then I'm going to go into the extracted folder and into the designs for POD actions folder. Okay. I'm just going to move this one. Well, first of all, in fact, what I'm going to do is come down to local disk C. I'm going to right click and open in a new window so that I have two open. So here's my set of actions that I've already got on my window, on my uh, C drive. I'm just gonna reduce this folder a little and move this one over here a little. So all we need to do essentially is copy the files from one, uh, the, from your new set into your old set. So over here I can see that this one's in my local disk C. So I'm gonna go into the uh, art PNGs. I'm gonna go into the art PNGs here. Now, this one's for the double white mug, so it has two new um, art PNGs. So we can just copy those and move them over. Now, a lot of them are going to run from the 2800 by 3200. Now, you can drag it over anyway just to make sure you got it and it'll overwrite. You can use these breadcrumbs up here to go backwards and then going to go to art PSDs on that one, art PSDs on this one. Now, this one is the same. So what I'm going to do is just drag it and show you. You can drag them anyway and then hit replace file just to be on the safe side to make sure you've got them. Then I'm going to come back. Um, I'm going to put bring the assets over or the actions just so that I've got them uh, in my C drive safe because if you delete them from Photoshop, there's no way of getting them back. So you want to keep these always in here just so you've got them just in case uh, you do anything wrong. Then I'm going to go into mock-up PSDs on that side mock up PSDs on here again drag drop then it's going to be published mockups published mockups and then drag those across to there like that okay now it's here now on our desktop we can get rid of this so I'm just going to right click and delete I'm going to right click and delete the zip now you could keep the zip for a backup if you wanted to um, totally up to you then I'm going to close that one there. <clears throat> okay. Then all I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the Art PSD in Photoshop just so I've got it open and it's easier to look at. And then I'm going to come, make sure you've got your um, layers open. You should know how to do that by now. And then click these two little arrows so you've got your action panel open. And then click the three little lines, load actions. You may need to browse around to your C drive, go into your designs for POD actions folder okay go into your assets and then open up the the new actions that you've got in this case it's the double white mugs and you'll see what happens here in our actions uh, panel is it's added them as another set of actions so what you can do is click um, click the top layer if there's multiple layers click the top layer hold down shift click the bottom layer and that's not including the, the folder part here. That's the folder part with the icon. It's the ones with the little tiny arrows below. Grab and drag them up into your other actions and let go. You can then grab the folder at the bottom and drag that down to the trash can right at the bottom there. So you've got all your actions in one place. Now, as you grow your actions, uh, what I recommend you do is you always have the save art at the top, okay? Um, so within this within these actions here you can also grab them singly and you can move them up and down and arrange them how you want them so as your actions grow i recommend that you keep all save art actions at the top so you can work through your art first and then you can run all your mock-ups below that okay thanks guys and i'll catch you in the next video bye for now